Hello my YouTube friends, how are we today? Quick Smoke here with another cooking video? Yeah, it's a cooking video, but it's not my recipe. I was searching the web for things to cook and I came across uh, a gentleman by the name of Wolf Den Cooking, I believe it is. I will leave his link in the description. Uh, so you could, I'll leave the link to the video that I found in the description so you could check it out for yourself. We are going to make the poor man's Thanksgiving dinner, okay? It's very easy, very quick, so this is going to be a short video because I'm not going to show you making everything. I'm just going to show you the ingredients and then I'll show you the result when it's done. So, one of the first and most important things that we need is turkey spam. Now, according to his video, this roasted in the oven at 375 degrees for roughly 20 minutes or until uh, the outer layer is as brown as you want it and it is hot inside. So... It's pretty small, so I have two for me and uh, Papa Smoke, and hopefully we'll have leftovers. Okay, so the next thing you're going to need is instant turkey gravy. Uh, I like a lot of it, so that makes about two cups right there. Um, this is all pretty much going to be instant stuff. The next thing we're going to need is let me see uh, instant mashed potatoes uh, this is again mix about two cups uh, adjust according to the amount of people that you're going to feed um, this particular brand is pretty good uh, I will show you the back of it because uh, I don't know if you can see this but it says to add two cups of boiling water what I do is I use two cups of milk instead and bring it to a boil and then I add butter and then the mashed potatoes mix. The next thing we're gonna need is stovetop turkey stuffing. Uh, again, I'm gonna show you the back because what it tells you to do is um, put chopped turkey in it and all other kinds of stuff. I am going to, uh, it says to make it with water, I believe. Yeah, we're gonna use something else. Um, it's the same thing with the gravy, it tells you to use water. We're gonna be using actually turkey broth. Okay. Uh, it, it's not bad. It's uh, it, it's very good when you use it for other things, uh, gravies and stuff like that. And the final thing you're gonna want is a good old can of jellied cranberry. So uh, those that's it. That's all you're gonna need um, for equipment. You're gonna need a stove, a couple pots, some stirrers. In a pan rack. So what we're gonna do is while my oven is preheating to 375, I'm gonna open up the spam and hopefully get it out of here. Uh, nothing ever wants to cooperate. There we go. So there's one loaf. He said to bang it. Sorry for the loud bang. All right. I can say this smells like regular spam to me. There we go. There's our second loaf. Sorry about the large bangs. We're gonna put this together. Uh, and then we're going to throw it in the oven for about 20 minutes. 
And uh, I don't think I need to show you how to make uh, instant gravy, uh, mashed potatoes, and uh, stuffing. So I will bring you back when everything is ready to be served. Uh, so we will see you here in a minute. All right. We are back. It is all done. Please excuse the noise in the background. Papa Smokes is shredding papers. So here we go. We have it completely co uh, cooked. Took about a half hour to make. Uh, it smells delicious. It looks interesting. So uh, if you can see right here. I don't know if, how well you can see it. Let me see if I can bring it down. The Spam is kind of brown it has like a skin type on it let's see if it tastes like turkey or if it tastes like spam I got a little gravy on here dip it in a little bit more gravy it's not bad I'd actually would make this again uh, this is very good for people who are limited on budget, but want to have that Thanksgiving theme. Let me try these mashed potatoes here. Mmm. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. That gravy really complements it. Mmm. Yeah. I would definitely, definitely make this again. And if you want it, like, you don't want to buy a whole turkey... Or you just can't afford a turkey. Or if you just buy yourself and you want like that Thanksgiving dinner. This would do it. This would, this, would, this would make the cut. And on top of that. I think if you had enough leftovers. With the cranberry. The gravy. The uh, stuffing and the spam. You can make a Thanksgiving hoagie out of this. Or sub. Whichever you want to call it. And uh, it'd be absolutely delicious. So that is my poor man's Thanksgiving dinner that I saw on Wolf Den Cooking. Uh, again, I, I, I'm probably getting his name wrong, but I'll link his uh, channel, his the video that I got this from, in the description. And uh, yeah, we'll try something else later on down the road. So I'm gonna say, hey, if you like this, like this. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. And we'll have some good eats together. Have a good one.